Russia and Indonesia are deepening their military ties with new defense agreements and joint activities. Russia has confirmed receiving an official request from Indonesia for the acquisition of weapons and military equipment for the period between 2025 and 2030. Vladimir Bulovin, head of the Federation Council Committee on Defense and Security, announced that this request is currently under review. He also noted that the two nations are already working on seven contracts as part of their military technical cooperation. These contracts involve the delivery of various weapons and military equipment, with several projects in progress. According to Bulovin, Russia is preparing proposals to address Indonesia's latest request, reflecting the growing partnership between the two countries. The collaboration doesn't stop at equipment. Russia has been actively training Indonesian military personnel, with over 6,000 specialists trained by Russian instructors. Recently, dozens of Indonesian pilots practiced using Su-27 flight simulators, demonstrating the depth of the relationship. In early November, from the 4th to the 8th, Russia and Indonesia held their first joint naval exercises in Surabaya, called Arutub 2024. These exercises mark a significant step in enhancing maritime security and defense cooperation. The military relationship between Russia and Indonesia dates back to the Soviet era, when the Soviet Union supplied arms and equipment to Indonesia in the 1950s and 1960s. After a pause during the Cold War, cooperation resumed in the 2000s with major contracts for fighter jets and armored vehicles, including the BMP-3F, a vehicle designed for amphibious operations. Looking ahead, both countries appear eager to continue building on this foundation. Indonesia has even expressed interest in participating in Russia's naval parades, further strengthening ties. As Indonesia seeks to diversify its armed suppliers, this partnership with Russia is expected to grow, paving the way for enhanced military cooperation and regional security in the coming years.